Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. And today, we got some more stuff set up. I want to kind of show you all what all more we got set up ready to rock and roll. As you can probably see, we got some more paths ready to roll. We picked up some more equipment, got everything kind of settled in where it needs to go. We're getting everything ready to rock and roll, so the next episode that we do here will be get ready to chop some corn here we're going to start everything out kind of solo well uh, i still gotta buy the hay equipment and everything but to kind of give you all an idea of what we got going on we got this all set up ready to rock and roll pads already kind of made i kind of messed up here on this but we'll fix it later on got our cows all set up ready to roll we got our mineral cow mineral so we ain't gotta buy a bunch of pallets we got our lights set up so we got our mineral here we got ourselves a fuel tank over here ready to rock and roll as well i still need to get a water tank we'll buy that here later on but the fuel tanks here so guys real quick if you all do enjoy this smash like on the down below make that like button turn blue whatever it changes colors to uh, also hit that subscribe if you're new to the channel so here is our equipment lineup so far we got our x9 combine fully animated by the way so if you click right here all the way around this machine it is Come on. We're around here somewhere. This is why I don't like doing this stuff with the hell at all. But I like that. That adds some more realism to everything. We got our uh, combine here, or our Ford Harvester, John Deere Ford Harvester. We got our 8300 hooked to the Kinsey with the scale in the cab. We got a T7 New Holland hooked to a disc we got our plow here hooked up to a fence 9 930 then we got our 8410 hooked to the Kinsey planter and then we also have a case international 7140 hooked to a John Deere 455 we got some more lights set up here as well Now everything that you see, except for like this, will not be in the uh, multiplayer server. This is still not released to the public. We got our grain bin set up. So we gotta get straw at some point. So we gotta be able to harvest at least some wheat, soybeans, stuff like that. In this shed here, we got our 4255 hooked to our manure spreader. We got our T6 hooked up to this. The uh, feed mixer. We got our liquid fertilizer. We got our dry fertilizer. And then we got our seed. Of course, we got the old 4020 sitting here next to the 6410 with the front loader. And now we're going to buy our hay equipment. Like our baler, stuff like that. So we need a baler, round baler, um, we're going to pick up the coon baler because that coon baler works with the, it works with the baler box in the 4240, so we'll have to buy one of those as well, um, should I get a square baler too? I think so. Let's get ourselves a chrome baler. We got the big tractor, so we shouldn't have to worry about any of that. And then let's go ahead and get ourselves a stack wagon for the baler, round baler. Or not the round baler, the square baler. Um, hmm. Should we just get this walk? Yeah, let's get this. Uh, 
And then we'll also need to get a mower. That's a roller. Hmm. Yeah, the X knot or the uh, fent has this three point on the front. Or license plate. Need a hay tether. Let's go ahead and just get the biggest one. Now we'll also need a wind rower. I'm trying to mix it up a little bit. So we're not getting all John Deere equipment. We're all not getting all New Holland. We're not getting all of the leveler. International 86. Uh, yeah. Let's go and get that. Let's come up here. Auxiliary. Make this one a uh, I can live with that. All right, so let's um, uh, let's get some stuff moved. So I guess I didn't do that right. So I'll figure that off. I'll figure that out off of camera. Back this in without turning nothing off. Let's buy our 40 series real quick. While I'm thinking about it. Throw on one. This is it. Do a half weights. All those is right.
Sadly, this will be as, as most organized as things are ever going to be. Yeah, hi, good for that. I believe this Massey has a high hitch on it. No, it don't. What do I have that has a high hitch on it? Nope, this one don't even have it either. That don't. Does this load it? I wonder if this New Holland does back here. Nope. Nope. No, that don't. Maybe the 40 does. 4240. Yeah. Uh, mm, yep. Has I drawn it? Actually, did I put the other baler in there? The New Holland. No, I did not. I need to add that New Holland, because that New Holland don't do what this crown does. There's a king baler. And we'll buy a tractor specially for this mower. Mm. You know, let's do a fan. Seven series. Do a GPS. Um... Yeah, I'm happy with that. Let's go ahead and buy this. And this will be our strictly mowing tractor.
And then to finish out today's video, guys, we are going to pick ourselves up. A very nice red semi. We'll need a grain trailer. Wilson. Always prefer Wilson. Do stainless steel rim color. Uh, just leave that. White. And then we get ourselves... A low loader, which will probably wind up selling some certain things. So, guys, we're going to wrap up the video here. Thank you all so much for watching. We'll see you all in the next one. Again, smash that like, hit that subscribe if you're new, and we'll see you all in the next one later on.